Hey everybody, the Bang is here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play Tempo for the Sega 32X, brought to you by GameAnyone.com, of course. Now, this game has a very huge cult following, even though the Sega 32X itself was never all that popular. But of course, with 32-bit graphics, it does look pretty appealing. It's got a pretty good music theme, and it looks like a fireplace of some sort, with four arms. Alright, let's look at the options, shall we? See what we gotta deal with. Um, well, we'll go with normal, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna skip that intro again. Hopefully it doesn't sound too loud on the video itself, but I guess we'll find out. Now let's get this started. Basically, you're on this show called the Major Minor Show, which is pretty funny. You get five levels to choose from, and then you can go to the final area. You have to beat five levels before you can actually go to the final stage. We'll go with this one first. This one looks like a shoe. Downtown Performance. I like the graphics and I like the music, but the controls leave a little to be desired. I mean, the C button is basically your attack, B's jump, and A is your kick. Well, the C button is basically your projectile attack that only stuns enemies, it doesn't kill them. And to dash, you just gotta tap the forward twice. But if you hit a wall, even when you're about to slow down, you take it. You don't take damage, but you get slowed right down. You stop, you stall. And then you get pretty much get hit by a free hit. And that sucks. If you throw like the uh, music notes at them, which is C attack, you can stun them and get a chance for a free strike. And keep tapping the jump button so you can actually keep flying. But actually holding B works too. Just tap A, I mean tap B while you're midair. I've never beaten this game, it can be quite frustrating, trust me on this one. Get music notes to replenish your health. A little teleporter. But luckily the arrows there tell you where to go. They're pretty small, but keep an eye out for them. Now here's a little power up that I'm going to find interesting, if I can get there. Dance! Yeah, you're hoping for the win! Kill all enemies on screen, and you get yourself a new partner. She'll attack enemies for you as well. Not only that, the music actually sounds better. Like it adds more theme and more beat to it. And by yourself, it's just like one little beat. This time it's two. And you can actually do like a little wall kick too to actually get up a little further. It kind of works like the wall jump on Metroid. But, it's got its own charm. Yeah, I'll that way, thank you. Yeah, this game can be quite frustrating if you're not careful. Especially when everything looks like something. Yeah, it got some CDs! Believe it or not, it's a force field. What the fuck? What are cows doing? That's just random cow is just going from the bottom all the way to the top. The random cow yodel attack. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. There's a lot of LSD that just went into this game. Let's grab the other teleporters, see where we're gonna go. Ah, so of those music notes. You gotta get them all so you can get like a power up of some sorts. These don't give you health, but. Apparently that one doesn't either. Let me grab this one. You pretty much get something good if you get all the notes that do this. Oh, a thousand points and I win my cat. I try my best not to run too much because I don't want to run smack into a wall getting stunned. Oh, I gotta go 
I'll go back over here. Get myself all freshened up. And it's action. Every time this happens, you gotta take on a boss. What's this do? Giant boot. I'll just use a kick in there. Yeah, you don't want to try jumping on him when he's stunned. Uh, see, I hate this boss. Because of the control movement. See, even if you're completely broke, like hitting the brake, you still get hit. Okay, I keep forgetting that you don't even have to, like, do a jump. You can just kick him just fine. Okay, you kick him for me, will ya? Or just run into him like a jackass. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. Alright. Start to grab the dance power up. That should do some damage, too. If you got, like, this little chick there with you, it's gonna make this battle a lot easier. Did that missile drop kick? That was cool. I'll grab that. And it looks like the boss is getting a bit smaller. So just keep this up and you'll be fine. Yeah, I do get frustrated with this game, I'm not gonna lie. Come on, kick it for me. Thank you. Oh, second phase. Now it's even bigger. Oh, oh uh, yeah, that's great. I had no clue where he was going. But I win. Yay, it's over! I'll kick you around, little bitch. Dance time! Yeah! Woo! Is that the pelvic thrust dance or something? What the hell did I move is that? I bet you if I tried that in a nightclub, I would probably get kicked out by everybody. And probably bludgeon to death. Alright, let's see. I didn't get a lot of points. But yeah, I think I'm gonna stop the video right here. I'll probably do like one level per video. But that seems only fair, right? Stay tuned for the next part. See ya!